You said for data protection, you should purposes. You've confirmed that you are the account holder or have authority to place a booking today. Is that correct? I am. Can you please confirm the first line of your address and postcode? Yeah, but normally, do you have my, my name? If you have my name, then you have my address and postcode too. I have everything on system. For data protection, I'm not allowed to actually confirm this with you to you. I would need you to confirm it to me to match it on what I, as to what I have on system. Uh, just in case you are the incorrect person that I'm speaking to. All right. It's... What, what do you want? Do you want the... Uh, okay. The first line of address and postcode. Okay, it's uh, NG68AJ. Okay, I'm afraid that's not what we have on system for you, okay? Okay. Alright, so... Your first line of address should be? You mean the address? Your first line of address? It's 25. Okay, unfortunately that's not what we have on the system, okay? Now, okay. our calls are recorded for quality and compliance purposes. I would not be able to continue with this call as um, we may have the incorrect details or you may be the incorrect person that we're speaking to. I am the correct person and I gave you the wrong wrong address. Just all that to see that is it, uh, you know, who is calling me and for what and from where. Okay. Because I gave you the wrong oh, okay. address, I know right. that. That's why oh, I gave okay, you the wrong address. Right. So thank you for making. And who's? Okay, can thank you, you for making me aware of that. Can you tell me that who? Uh, who's gonna talk on my phone here? It's only me. And you are saying just we want to know that okay, is that you. you. See the reason. You see the reason we do this is because what if you are a visitor at the customer's house and you pick up their mobile when we call. And we just pass out information to you of that person, the, which you're not supposed to have. So that's actually, um, it's going against DPA. Uh, it's going okay, against, it's going against what? Is it's going against what? DPA, data protection. Yeah, okay. you mean GDPR. You mean GDPR. Sorry, yeah. Yeah. Yes, it, GDPR it, and also against... Data Protection Act, okay? That is a data protection, so, that is a data protection GDPR. That's correct, okay. So, if you could kindly confirm your correct address and postcode, I'll provide you with more information as to what we number are it's, uh, yeah, what that's incorrect. I'm afraid I won't be able to continue. Mm -hmm. So, Adal, is it fine for me to call you by your first name? And am I pronouncing it correctly? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thank you. Now, the please thank you very much. So, the reason that we are calling you today, as part of a national program to future-proof the outdated energy system. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we actually need our energy system to be modernized to cope as the demand for electricity is predicted to double by 2050. Mm -hmm. In fact, all homes in this will offer the smart meter by their supplier by the end of 2020, okay? Mm -hmm. So basically what it is that we will upgrade your current meter to a second generation smart two version. So do I, do, smart meter. so do I need to pay anything? No, you don't pay anything at all. Okay, it's absolutely free of charge. We do value you as a customer. And right now, the installation as well as the meter and in-home display will be free of charge. Mm -hmm. Now, this is going to automatically, this meter is going to benefit you in many ways. Firstly, it's going to send automatically, automatically send meter readings to Green Network Energy, making your bills much more exact. So, okay? So can you comes with an in-home display, yeah? So can you tell me how I'm gonna, how you're gonna bring the electric from Africa to England? 
<laughs> I don't bring it from Africa to England, to Alice. Uh, we do have our, uh, our engineers based in England, okay? So we have many engineers. In England, all we right. oh, all right. for you. All right, the engineers they're yeah, gonna the, the engineers they're gonna bring the electric from Africa and bring it here uh, directly. To you, or how? They're not going to do that. They actually everything will be done from England. Okay, it's just the booking of your appointment will be done from here because we are an offshore call center based in South Africa. Okay. <laughs> just I wonder how how it's possible. Just I wonder how it's possible. Why they didn't call me from England here and they they calling me from uh, South Africa? Okay, we do have. We also have club. We also have agents based in England. Okay. Uh huh. Um, I can't. I, I, to be quite honest with you, I can't provide you with that answer. Okay. All I can tell you is that we are an offshore call center once again. We are based in South Africa. Everything is legitimate, and we are part. Network energy. Yeah, okay. But, yeah, but I. I, I do have your data on system. Yeah, but I see here the number is O two zero three nine zero seven six three six one. That means it's from England. Uh, yeah, absolutely. And okay. You are saying that. As I said, we are an offshore. We are not South Af We are not a South African company. This is an offshore company. That is why you'll find that the number would be from England, okay? All right. Yeah. Yeah. So, Adele, now how this is actually going to work, our technicians, uh, sorry, our engineers will actually come to you on a specific date that you actually select uh, where you're most available. I didn't they select come yet. will and get the insulation. I didn't select yet. No, I do understand. I'm just explaining. I do understand, I'm just explaining how it would work once you select it, okay? I choose a date uh, at your convenience, alright? It basically, insulation takes about an hour and a half, alright? <coughs> yeah, but can they do so, that in, in year 2021? Because 2020 here now it's uh, coronavirus and it's everything It's uh, in quarantine. Even South Africa has... Even South Africa is a level one of the lockdown. Okay? Oh, you have that too. I understand. I can speak to many countries. Oh. <laughs> the entire world experiences this, Adele. Okay? Mm -hmm. So, to be quite honest, we are an essential company. All right? And it's actually appropriate as well because we take full, our engineers take full precaution as to space, when it comes to safety. Will they, have, yourself, will they have your family and yourself as well? Will they have the engineers uh, double masks and uh, gloves and uh, shoes normally they will be coming? Absolutely, they will be wearing full PPE, okay, with the glasses, shoe mask, shoe covers, mask, and they will also sanitize. They will also wear a visor, a visor or a mask. Okay. Disposable gloves and shoe covers. Okay. Are they gonna are they, they gonna come uh, are they gonna come female engineers or male engineers? Okay. So uh, I'm not too sure which engineers you are going to get. Depends on who's assigned to your area at that point in time. Okay. No. Now, do you know why I'm asking you about that? I would that. like to. Yeah. Do, do you know why yeah. I'm asking you about that? Are they coming female engineers no. or male? Because to be honest with no, you, to be honest with you, I'm single, and I thought that if they come female engineers, maybe they will fall in love with me, and uh, they can work here. Also, they can live with me. <laughs> I like your you. I like your you, my darling. Okay. All just right. I so hope. I hope. Further. Just I hope that uh, male engineers, if they come, I'm gonna just kick them out and to say I don't want any male engineers. Okay, at the hell, without any, without wasting any of your time and my time, okay? Um, once again, please note, all calls are recorded for quality and compliance purposes. Now, yeah, yeah, I know, I, I know that because, the, I, know about the I know that this is recording because uh, I never say anything bad things on the phone or no, to anybody. No, you have not said anything bad, I just need to I'm really nice with the ladies, like always. <laughs> okay, so... 
Due to the current situation, I do first need to check whether it would be safe to carry out your installation, okay? Yeah, but first I just wanted to tell you something, if it's possible. Because uh, mm -hmm. when, I, when I said to you that uh, I am single and I need a female engineer because my girlfriend, she died about uh, four or five months. When I was trying I'm to so call, sorry to hear that. I was trying to call on, on the phone. Then uh, after four, mo four months, when I saw her in town, and I said, I said to myself, is this a zombie or what? And I asked her, I said, why you live? She said, oh, I'm still alive. Why? My mother, she was answering on the phone. I said, yeah, but you're supposed to be dead. And go back to the grave then. And I don't want to see you anymore because you died. No, no, I'm still alive. I'm still alive. She said, okay, then. And so that's why I, I was afraid to go with the zombies again. So that's why I need to have... One girl with no zombies. Okay, Adele, I hear you. Alright, I'm sorry for your experience. No, don't be. Okay. I'm, hap I'm so happy that she died. I mean, she died for me. I'm happy. But now, now so that I'm free, I need to find another one. But you are far away from here. You are in okay. South Africa. Because if you will be here, then we could go on to have a coffee. And then maybe after coffee, you know what it comes. Uh, a dinner. Okay, alright. Um, uh, going back to the reason for this call, okay, the benefits of having a smart meter, Adele, okay, that's going to now provide you with, it's actually wireless, okay? Wireless? It's, it's wireless, yes, yeah, it but is wireless. Yeah, but I already have a wireless, the phone, the laptop, I have two laptops here, wireless, and the iPads. Why do I need wireless? Okay, so why do you need a wireless? Okay, this is going to actually be much more, um, much more convenient. Okay, yeah. with regards to the automatic readings that will be sent out to the network energy, so your smart meter will send out the readings automatically, so you don't have to do it uh, physically or manually. It will so provide you with more accurate bill. So that means I need to pay again double. I need to pay for the EE. You're not going to pay double. The network wireless. You are not system. going to pay. Yeah, but you, you are just not said going because to I have, pay anything. I have the wireless network, and you just said that you need uh, to have another wireless. Uh, I really am so confused. I don't understand this. So the smart people do a secure national communication network, okay? Yeah, but can but I do it? Can I can I do it that just from one laptop? Because you said that okay, you have so wireless. Okay, so you won't have to do it in the future. Okay, so you won't have to do that by yourself. Your readings will be sent automatically. Okay, you can choose whether it's going to be half hourly, daily, or monthly. Now, if you do have a smart meter, you don't need to rely on the estimated energy bulb. Yeah, we'll but provide madam, your own madam, regular reading. madam, sorry, sorry, just, just one second, because really, really, I'm confused about this one. You are saying that I will have a wireless. I have a wireless. I have two iPhones, one Android phone. I have two computer laptops. I'm speaking about Adele. I need you to understand. Sorry to interrupt you. I need you to understand now. We are merely talking about the meter that we yeah, told you yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, that, that's the meter that I have the. I, have the I understand you may have a wireless phone, you may have a wireless laptop, everything is wireless now. Everything yeah, but is why do I need a wireless when I okay, have a wireless uh, the phone and the laptops? I don't need a wireless laptop. Okay, well, there, actually there's much more benefits, uh, there's much more other benefits that we're actually calling about regarding the smart meter, okay? Now, if you'll allow me just a few moments to provide you with those benefits, just know um, that to ask you, because if you want, sense. just know that to ask you, because I have the smart uh, modem here, and it's, uh, wait, I need to get up and to see that, it's EE smart um, uh, modem, and it works, that one it's a wireless, it works for the laptops and everything, and you want to, you want to make it again for the, another modem to send it to me and for laptops. I don't know what I need for laptops. We are not calling. 
Yeah. We are not calling you about that, okay? We are not calling you about your other devices. We are calling you about the smart meter. Yeah, th okay? th that is Something wireless. Something that you're going to be dependent on to provide you with accurate bulbs instead of estimated bulbs, mm -hmm. okay? So the smart meter send precise meter readings to us, so you only pay for the energy that you use. You yeah. can monitor your spending. Yeah, and that is wi wireless, yeah? Display, is it is it that wireless? With your in home, yes. With your in home display, which is a little LCD screen that you will be given as well, you will be able to see in re near real time your energy cost in pounds and pence. Yeah, but can, can I do it? Can, goes to reduce can I do it that uh, wireless through my laptop? Because I have also TV yes, wireless. you will be able to. You will need to actually uh, get the app, okay? There is an app available that will make things much simpler for yourself, okay? Is it? Yeah. Oh. So you can even set alerts and goals to reduce your usage. You'll get quicker response to power cuts. If there's a power cut, your smart meter will be able to send a message to your oh, local network no. provider. Now I get it. What did that you say? Your power should be now I get it, and you were saying yeah. to me that wireless and those things, I thought that it's for laptop. You meant about no, the smart not. meter, the electric meter. That's correct. Ah, my the electric and gas meter, okay? Why didn't tell me yesterday? So, actually, this is a smart... Sorry? Uh, why didn't tell me before? I'm oh. sorry, I should have made myself more clear. Okay? My God, so, the smart meter is... But the smart meter, I have here one smart meter. I do understand you may have a smart meter, but what you have is the smart meter, the first generation smart meter, okay? Mm -hmm. What we're offering you right now is a second generation smart meter. Uh, second that's actually that means second generation, that means about uh, oldish, older than the first one, because, yeah, some kind of something like that. But I have the smart meter okay, here, you the and I'm paying. I'm paying that uh, twenty-five pound a month. And it's okay, really so like actually, what we? Yeah. I understand that you may have the smart meter at the moment, okay? So what you have is not the second generation smart meter, correct? Yeah, it's the yeah, first generation, yeah. Yeah, but it's working. We are calling you. Yeah, completely understand, okay? There have been many bad reviews as well, taken all of that into consideration. That is why we've come up with the second generation smart meter. And you being a valued customer of Green Network Energy since the 27th of March 2019, mm -hmm. we would like to actually provide this to you free of charge, as well as provide you with insulation at your convenience free of charge as well. Okay? okay, so that when it becomes a requirement, you already have the smart meter second generation. Okay, even count me in. I, I'll give you my, count me in. I'll give you my bank card. Just I don't me. need your banking details, okay? So what do we need? Okay, so basically what it is is that um, I do need to do a, I do need to first check that it would be safe to carry out the installation for you. So is there anyone in your household that's showing any symptoms of COVID-19 or self-isolating? Yes. That's why I said that's why I said that in year 2021 to come, not not this year. Completely understand, but are you showing symptoms? Is anyone in your household showing any symptoms of COVID-19 or is anyone self-isolating because of uh, because they have the virus or they came into contact with someone that has the virus? To be honest with you, yesterday I had a barbecue outside and it showed me the symptoms because I ate, I think, so too much meat. So, I really, I don't know. I had the symptoms, really, I had a, a stomach pain and I don't know, what is it? Okay, so you ate too much of meat. Uh, doesn't mean that you have the virus, okay? Oh, is it? Oh, I thought that maybe the meat is broken. As well, uh, I think we need to be actually on a more serious level. I like your humor, but at this moment, I actually need to get through this call. I need to help you uh, find you a more suitable, suitable date for the 
uh, engineer to actually get out to you to make to actually make this booking for you. Okay. Okay, but first I need I need just to ask you that are you in, are you from England and you went in Africa or you are you living in Africa? Have you ever been in in England? I do. I've never been to England. I actually would love to be to be at uh, be in England. Okay. Do you want me to send you a visa and then we can live together? No, thank you. That would be fine. Okay? Why? That's okay. I'll I'm offering you. Maybe at a later stage. Not now. Maybe at a later stage. Thank I, you very much for yeah, the offer. Yeah, but I am a handsome guy. Hello. Okay. Sorry. I am a handsome guy. Okay, that's good to hear. Um, Adele, I'm actually going to need to give you a call back tomorrow, is that fine? What's the best time to call you back tomorrow? Oh, about 9, 10 o'clock uh, night time, because I'm working. Um, unfortunately, I won't be able to call you around that time, but I can give you a call around about um, 7-ish, uh, sorry, half past 6. I do end my shift at 7. No, because still I'm working and I'm not allowed uh, the phone to use that. Cool. So okay, 12, how about 12, 12 hours shift and so that's why today I needed just to do something and I took that uh, early. Oh, I'm really sorry. Okay, uh, when would you be available? Are you available don't on be, Saturday? Don't be sorry, at least I have a job. 12 hours a shift, don't be sorry. <laughs> That's why I thought that if you okay. if you want to come here, I could send you a visa, then you can live like a queen. <laughs> okay, I'm, uh, I'm afraid I can I cannot take up that offer. Okay. Why right, are, so you, are, are you available why, on Saturday? Are you married? Are you married? Um, no, I'm not. Oh, no, that's I'm good. Not. That's okay. good for me. So, okay. So, Adele, can we actually speak on Saturday? Uh, what? Are you available on Saturday? Saturday to meet you and me? No. Uh, actually to book your appointment for the smart meter. Mm. Ah, to book appointment. I thought that you are going to meet me. About appointment. Okay, so I'm afraid I have to actually say goodbye. I do. I actually end my shift now, okay? In the, uh, literally now I do end my shift, okay? Please don't go. So, don't go, don't go. So, I need to call you back on Saturday. Is uh, that fine? No, don't worry about that. Don't You don't need to call because uh, I already have everything here. And to be honest with you, okay, I'm no not, worries. to be honest with you, I'm not using electric anymore. I'm just using the candles. So, when I charge it, I, okay, charge, I charge it to my okay. neighbor here, second floor. Okay. Okay. All right, not a problem then. All right, thank you so much for your time. You're and welcome. Take care, all the best. Love you, bye. Thank you, bye now. Love you. Love you. <laughs> <laughs>